take a shot at this. <clears throat> Stop at 30. Going to look to take off half at 10 right now. Looking for a move down to 10,500 right now. Green line's at 5.32. Going to try to tighten this stop up as quickly as I can here. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and tighten this stop up here late in the day. Late in the day trade, I'm just looking for it to fall quickly. Looking at for it to fall quickly and not come back. No risk right now. No risk on my trade. Just commission costs at this point. Locking in one tick here. Going to be a little bit aggressive on this entry point. Cancel all. I'm going to buy one back here. Buy one back. I'm just going to take some money on this off this trade here. Other at break even. I just want to make sure I make a little bit of money today. Uh, it's been a pretty rough market to trade. I'm going to look at the other side of this trade. Just just taking a little bit of money here today. Get just have a little just a little bit. Just a little bit of money. See if we can catch this green line on our second contract. We have a shot to run 10490. I got five off right now. <clears throat> I get 30 ticks on two. That means I need 25 more. No, I'm busy, bud. Looking at ten four ninety five on the second. I'm out. Doesn't matter. <clears throat> oh well. Let me uh, cancel all here. Make sure I don't have something hanging out. Late in the day, uh, trade management today taking over, closing in on 11.30 mark. I just wanted to see the market just run down right here. This market can go on down here. I think it does. I think it runs down here and below. 
you're still in my one consider 10495 it's lower target right now putting some meat in my trades here I'm just kinda glad that I finally got into something might want to consider if you haven't made any exit at all right now might want to consider 10505 out for one 10495 out on the rest or fall along the green line dang it that just came back and got me out right there at 19 a little bit of um, trade management late in the day <laughs> I don't really I don't really have much confidence on any of the movement today so I was pretty tight on my stops today now it's gonna come down huh pain in my ass there's 10 damn it oh well got six on the trade probably could have managed this one a little bit better but I was looking at all these red bars in front of this trade right here before I got in so I wanted to manage this trade a little bit better uh, looking at time uh, looking at time at 1121 here time was against us on this trade coming into lunch so I wanted to manage this a little bit more than I normally do I don't have any confidence on any of the movement if we look back here we not haven't we haven't really seen any nice trend movement at all yet. So um, the um, oh, there's a spike reversal bar. Be careful on your sh uh, any short entries here. Might want to tighten those stops up. On, uh, I would recommend break even if you haven't got the break even yet. All right, I'm out of this one though. Well, the market coming back to break even here. You're able to lowest it got roughly was at 10.508 on this downswing move before knocking you out up here at break even uh, for any remaining contracts. So we uh, had two trades uh, considerations. One here at the 9:45 mark a.m. Eastern time. Second one coming in here 11:15 a.m. Eastern time. Uh, and we uh, put our end-of-day trading rules in place, uh, at least I did, uh, money management techniques and so forth to protect this trade position. Certainly didn't want this one to go against us late in the day. Um, yeah, it is what it is. It's a Monday. Mondays are pretty tough to trade all by themselves. So I, I know some traders that don't even bother trading Mondays. They just wait for Tuesday, trade Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and just trade midweek make all their money at the mid of the week and then have a have four day weekends every week <laughs> nothing wrong with that it's Dave Knight here at Knight Capital Management thanks for being here it's the end of the recording for the day I am going to stop recording see you a little bit later see you tomorrow Tuesday Tuesday trading all right Dave Knight here at Knight Capital Management today was Monday March 15 2010 uh, we had uh, two trade possibilities on the day First trade came in at 9.45 Eastern Time. Had a little computer glitch, wasn't able to get in it. It was a break even plus two. Our second trade came in here, was able to get a little bit of profit on this one. Once again, uh, second trade came in 11.15 on a close below support line here. And that was able to knock out a little bit of profit. Uh, finished with six ticks positive, less two, uh, $20 net. Uh, twenty dollar u s net today uh, positive day on a non trending day is always a good thing. best thing to do a lot of times is uh, have your powder dry and stay on the sidelines. best opportunities to trade today eleven fifteen a m eastern time nine thirty nine forty five excuse me a m eastern time this morning with the two best opportunities everything else in the middle not so great we'll see you all tomorrow bye now